Just back it up, 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 back it up. Hi everyone, welcome back to our channel. If you're new here, my name is Hunter. And my name is Matthew. And obviously together we're Hunter and Matthew. So um, we've been together, all together for um, seven and a half years. We've, we've been married for a year and a half, but we've never really talked about how we met. So in this video, we would like to get into that. So if you like what you see, make sure you comment, like, subscribe, turn on bell notifications, and you'll get to hear more about our crazy life together and see us do more weird things. I haven't said like anything. You really said, I got this, which I'm like happy about. I don't like doing the intro. You're gonna do the intro from now on. Mm -hmm. Yes, you is. I guess we're not making videos anymore. Sorry, guys. Anyways. <laughs> so, Matthew, since you haven't talked yet, why don't you start? Okay, cool. We set met. the stage, set the scene. What was the smells? What what was the the backdrop? What was I wearing? I don't know what you were wearing. I'm gonna be honest. I know what you were wearing. What was I wearing? Something ugly. False. You had that that shaved head haircut. My little buzz cut. My little buzz cut. Oh. oh. And I probably had this exact haircut. <laughs> 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 if any broke, don't fix it. But we had met our sophomore year of high school in 2015. 12. <laughs> we graduated high school in 2015. Uh, 2012. <laughs> uh, we met uh, sophomore year. Sophomore year because my freshman year I had gone to a different school. And I had transferred into um, the performing arts school we went to. My first like memory of you was in ballet. Like that was the first time I like really remembered you. Okay, what was I doing? Well, ballet, we were just in class. <laughs> you were doing ballet? You were, you were in ballet. In the first position. <laughs> I think because do and we <laughs> faced each other on the, like we, you were on this side of the bar and I was on this side. So I just was looking at you often because you looked were like you like, knew what you were doing, were like, and I did it. <laughs> were you like, damn that? Mm -mm. Is that what you were thinking? No, I just said he's really good. I'm gonna watch him. And surely it wasn't that impressive. You well, were much more flexible than I was, so it made sense to look at you. Just a little eight ball. But that was the first time I like remembered you. Okay, the first time I cared that you were alive was... <laughs> the first time I cared that you were alive was when, right, um, right after um, 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 the stage door cast came, cast list came out. I thought that show was called? Stage door, yeah. So, um, sophomore year, our spring play was called Stage Door. And I had been there since freshman year. I was not casting anything freshman year. So sophomore year, I was like, this is my year. And I didn't get cast. Again, I think there was one, only one reason why I was cast. Anyways, and it's, and Matthew comes in sophomore year brand freaking new and he gets cast and I was like. Not as anything important, it's a character in two scenes and he has to have a southern accent and for some reason I think I was the only person who. I don't went. care, I was still toe up from the flow up. I was so. Angry, I held that anger for months. I think you still hold that anger. No! I sure don't let the past still affect me. Don't come for me. <laughs> I'll let it go. Gone, in the wind. So, I'm not mad. I'm not mad. So, that was sophomore year. So, sophomore year, I disliked Matthew quite a lot. I didn't know this fact at all. I truly just thought he just, we just weren't friends. I was like. And also Matthew came in, he's like, hi, my name's Matthew and I'm gay. Not only was I'm gay, I'm also dating him. Not, not someone in our class, but I was dating someone within the school. So I was known as Matthew who's dating so-and-so. So I came in. I came in hot. Guns a blazing. And 
me was still trying to figure out my life. So I think I had a lot of internal internalized homophobia. So I think I was projecting anger this direction. And I didn't know how to handle that yet. It didn't so affect me. You weren't like outwardly being like, I think Matthew sucks. But I was in here. I was thinking it. And then in the middle of spring semester, sophomore year is when I finally like came to terms with it and I came out. So yeah, all that happened. And <clears throat> then the you summer. came out sophomore year? Yes. To who? Sarah. Oh, was that it? Mm, Zoe, maybe, and... Oh, okay. I thought you meant like... And then they told everybody else. Okay. Yeah. Because I feel like I didn't hear it from you. Then when I came out... Which we could do a coming out video soon, too. If you yeah. Want to That's really fun. Well, no, it's not really fun, but... um, Came out to my friends only. So then junior year, I came in with a fresh attitude. And I was like, I am now out in semi-proud, but he me a man. And so I said, <laughs> I had my eyes set on Matthew and Matthew said, <laughs> I'm in danger. Here's the thing about me. Um, I'm very oblivious to a lot of things. People flirting with me is like number one on that list. Truly, you could walk up to me, and unless you verbatim say, I'm gonna flirt with you, I have no idea. I just think you're being nice. And so I was trying to get him to look at me in a certain way, and he just wasn't. And then he had the audacity to get another boyfriend. Right when I'm making my moves. And so then, I started hating him again. I was like, you know what? We're gonna go back I, to the, what we know. We're gonna go back to what we know. Go back to what we know. It worked the first time. <laughs> I was obviously right the first time. So let me go back to hating you. So I hated him again. Cause he got a different boyfriend and we're not shut the hell up about him. I'm sorry. And so I was like, you know what? Forget him. Forget him. So that was um, fall semester of junior year. And then you know, winter happened, Christmas happened. Yeah, and, and we, we had broken up the previous blue boyfriend that we, Hunter was talking about, we had just broken up. And so, um, I still wouldn't shut up about that. Yeah, you just kept on bringing him up. Just kept talking about it. It was mad annoying. We were about to do um, the spring dance concert we were in this, <laughs> we were in this tap piece that our um, teacher choreographed. Yo, this this piece was kind of funny, but it was bizarre. So, in short, it was about dogs. It's a whole and tap piece. dancing about dogs. Yes. So I'm gonna sing a little of the song before I get copy written. It goes, I'm just a walking my dog, doing my thing, strumming along. It's like that, and we're just out here with these like dog leashes like those like, fake ones with like the invisible dog on it that's what we danced we were with. dancing we were doing our little shuffles and our flaps and um at the end at the end we brought out five live dogs and they're all like doing tricks around us and everything it was so cute but um during this dance concert matthew and i were in tech for it and we're just sitting in the audience waiting for our turn for the piece that we were in to go up and work on stage and I'm just talking to a friend about something and so Hunter from a couple of seats away just bursts into the conversation. I was like, hello, hi. Embarrassing. I was eavesdropping mad hard. And it was a, a subtle enough flirt for me to like, okay, not, not subtle. It was for not me. subtle. <laughs> it was a very blatant enough flirt to me for me to go. Does he I don't. Like me? I don't know what came over me that day. But it was funny because I watched you retract into the chair because he was what like- What did I say? You and your, um, our friend were talking about 
V cards and like we were making jokes to be like I collected 27, I collected four. Just making like uh, like jokes like they're Pokemon cards or something like that. And then all of a sudden just like over here in the corner I hear Matthew has mine and I was like which is not even true. I am barely spoken to this man and yet here I am eavesdropping and said Matthew has my V card. Hey, what? what? It, and that's why I was like what came over me? What came over me? Also, let's back up. A month prior to that, um, we did this photo shoot together because our friend had some kind of... Um... She was a visual arts major at the school and she was doing this project where she took a whole bunch of photos and like laid them all together. And we just happened to be one of the photos. And so it was like this piece about the relationship between gay people and the church. And so we were holding hands outside of the church, yada, yada, yada. And so I think that day when I was holding Matthew's hand for like 30 minutes while she was Took taking photos. these pictures, I like, my mind sort of changed. It's like, oh, his hands feel kind of dry. I kind of like it. No, you don't. I know, you need to put on lotion. Black people, you'll never see us without lotion. I know. They might have... What's very interesting, a lot of black people come up to me at work and be like, Matt, do you have lotion, right? Because you're married to me? I, I don't know. But everyone assumes I have lotion. And Taylor Sante. I know. Because I don't have lotion. Yeah, we know. We can tell. We know. Well, we know. We already knew. <laughs> and so from that, that was in January. And then tech was in February. Maybe. Something like that. I don't know. Uh, tech was in February. And that's when I said that thing about the V-card. And it was out there now. Matthew been done new and how I felt, I Well, guess. no, I didn't. I just thought you were flirting and I was like, does he like me? Does he not? Was he just saying a joke? Are we trying to be friends now? So we started texting more. And then a, like a week later was the Valentine's homecoming. And I'm like, we didn't go with each other, but we made sure the other one was there. Yeah, I was like, you gonna be there? And I was like, I, maybe I'll go if you go. I said, I bet. And so we were both there, and we didn't dance with we, each other. We were other. like, we were like, waiting for the other one to make the move, and no move was made. <laughs> we were nervous. Um, why are you so nervous? I'm so nervous. <laughs> and so, um, that was on, I think it was on Valentine's Day. I think it was. And so then we started texting like nonstop between Well, men. I don't know if you remember this. Uh, it's something that like really stuck with me. After the dance was over, a bunch of us went to like this little like cookie ice cream place. And we were all saying goodbye. And I go, and I went to Hunter and I was like, goodbye. I did one arm and I left. And I like so mad, I was like one armed him. I gave him a one arm hug. He knows I don't, he thinks I don't like him. He doesn't think I like because him. Because we just homies, we bro. We just homies, we just bro. We just... Hey, what's up? That's what's up, that's what's up. <laughs> but I was like, <sighs> but then we started texting nonstop and nonstop and um, we decided, no, what happened was my friend's birthday was coming up and he was like, Hunter, for my birthday, I want you to give me the present of you going out on a date with Matthew. I had no idea about this. And so I said, fine. So on our friend's what you, 17th birthday or whatever year that was, I said, Matthew, do you wanna like hang, hang out, out before the show tonight? And I was like, um, sure. Uh, and so we went on our first date which we actually recreated yeah. um, in that video linked here. We went on a date. We went on a date. Now we're divorced. It's where dry hands get you. <laughs> Sometimes I'm like, Matthew, let's hold hands. And then I said, never mind, because I feel how dry his hands are. Must feel. Well, mine are kind of. Oh, mine aren't dry. They're just. I had. I had waffles this morning, and I spilled some of the syrup on my hand, so they're still a little sticky. Long story short, met Matthew. Didn't care anything about him. Then I started to hate him. 
And then I decided to like him, then I hated him again. And then we held hands at the, in front of the church and I liked him again. And I made a really weird move against, not against him, move towards, move for him. You flirted with me. And then February 25th, 2014, we started dating. But my chain of events of how we met to how we started dating was I transferred schools. We were in class together. Many months later, he flirted with me. And then we went on a date and now we're together. It's very different um, Your chain of events. I couldn't give two, two craps if Hunter even no, you. No, no. I was after over obsessing over you. Obsessingly angry, obsessingly in love, obsessively daggers at you. Okay, well, um, thank you for going on that. Um, Back down memory lane. Is that how that song goes? Or I don't know. I don't know that's a black song you wouldn't know. I think it's a black song. We'll find out. And we will let you know. Mm -hmm. So thanks for going on that um, journey trip. with us. With us. Journey to the center of the earth. When to our souls. So hopefully that that story helps you understand our like dynamic a little bit better yeah and how we came to be how we are also this marks our eighth video in our tenth video we are going to do 10 questions for our 10 videos asked by you all so um get them questions get going them questions and them going comments. and we're going to answer our top 10 favorite ones in our 10th video yeah don't forget to like and subscribe and hit the bell notifications if you ding haven't ding. done that already okay so like I said last time, you ain't gotta go home. But you can't stay here. But you can't stay here. So, go look at another video. Out. Go look at another video. If go watch, watch our first date. Yeah. Shameless plug. Also, back up your phones. Bringing it back. Back up your phone. So, bye.